What's going on everybody? It's Josh from Everett Chevrolet Buick GMC Cadillac in Hickory, North Carolina. We are continuing our video series on the Cadillac XT4, comparing this 2024 Cadillac XT4 with the beautiful 2019 Mercedes-Benz GLC 300. Now you might be asking yourself, why would you compare two vehicles that are about five years apart? Well, both are considered luxury, high class uh, makes of vehicles and the Mercedes, uh, this is the one that we had available to us. So this is what we're gonna compare it with. We're gonna compare five things for you today. We're gonna compare the headlights, the tires, the display screens, how the ease of functional, uh, functionality of seating, as well as the lift gate. So let's get into it. So let's first talk about the 2024 Cadillac XT4. So the exterior front fish has been completely redesigned. We did a full walkthrough on this a week ago so check that out above here but um, but on this front the, the headlights are running down the side here this is going to really give you a nice classy look when you're driving down the road uh, it's going to kind of stand out from other vehicles at night uh, so that's definitely one thing we want to highlight so the second thing we wanted to point out in this comparison was the standard 18 inch wheels that come with this Cadillac XC4. Now you can upgrade this to 19 or 20 inch wheels. The 20 inch wheels is gonna give you kind of a more uh, classier look as you're driving down the road. Uh, it's gonna make the vehicle stand out more. So I would recommend upgrading on this vehicle to the 20 inch wheels. So as we move to the inside of the vehicle, the Cadillac XT4 is gonna come with a 33 inch display screen across the dash of the front of the vehicle. Now on that driver information side of that 33 inches, it's a continuous display screen that is actually over 9,000 pixels as well. But on the driver side of that, you're gonna be able to customize and personalize that to the information that you wanna see, whether it be your tire pressure, your oil life, uh, anything like that, uh, your distance on how much you have left in the tank. So anything like that you can customize on your driver side and then you're gonna have your infotainment side with things like Sirius XM, Google built-in as well. So definitely a lot of options there on that 30 inch display screen, allowing you to see everything that is going on in your vehicle while you're driving it. So as we continue to move through the vehicle, another thing that we wanted to point out was the ease of dropping down your back seats. Now, I don't know about you, but I, a lot of the times, am pulling up my SUV, kind of loading it up, and I need to drop those back seats. And so with the 2024 Cadillac XT4, there's an easy, kind of almost one finger button that you use to drop down those back seats. So that is a super nice feature that you have in this XT4, and you're gonna see a little different for the Mercedes-Benz. Now, the lift gate on the Cadillac XT4, you can use your key fob, to hit that button twice, that'll open up your lift gate automatically, and then there's a push to close button. There's also, if you wanna use your hand, there's a one touch button to lift your tailgate, so you can lift your tailgate with ease that way. Now let's check out the Mercedes-Benz. Now moving on over to the Mercedes-Benz, you're gonna notice on the front of this vehicle that large Mercedes-Benz logo, and comparing the headlights from the 2024 Cadillac XC4 to this 2019 Mercedes-Benz GLC 300, the headlights on this one, your running lights are gonna be LEDs. That kinda, to me, they kinda look like eyelashes on the vehicle, right? Uh, that might be a funny way to say it, but uh, those look really sleek, really nice. It does have the classic headlight, though, on the front, so that is kinda more classic looking in it. Now, moving down to the wheels. This 2019 is gonna come with 18-inch wheels. Now, you can upgrade that if you would like to whatever you want to with aftermarket wheels, but when you purchase this vehicle, off our lot, it's gonna come with the 18 inch wheels. The five spoke, really classy, as well as the Mercedes-Benz logo in the middle of that. Super awesome, definitely gonna make you stand out as you're driving down the road. Now coming to the inside of this vehicle, the infotainment system is a little different, uh, a little, it, it is very 2019, I would say it's a seven inch infotainment display screen, and then you have a separate driver information center that's there in the middle behind the steering wheel that you're used to seeing on most vehicles. So that seven inches, you're gonna have Bluetooth audio. There's no Apple CarPlay or Android uh, Auto in this vehicle. So kind of a little different uh, there, but you are gonna have a lot of features being able to control um, in that infotainment system, check out what's going on with your vehicle. Still a lot of functionality there, just not as updated, I would say, as the 2024. Like we did say, this is a model that is five years older, so it is gonna be a little different, but still, nonetheless, Mercedes-Benz is a classy um, make of vehicle. 
All right, now moving on to the back seats. This is kind of a cool feature, I think, of the Mercedes in storage is there is a one touch button uh, in the back for you to drop your seats. So you don't actually drop your seats with your hands or anything like that. When you come to it, there's a button in the back where you can drop your seats. And I think that's really convenient. Like I said, I tend to load my SUV up with stuff so I can open up that lift gate. If I need to load something and I don't have to walk around to the side of the vehicle to open it, I can just press that button and those seats will drop down for me. Now moving back to the lift gate and talking about that, with that on the key fob, you do press that button twice, hands-free lift gate to open up, as well as a one touch button to close. So that is the Mercedes-Benz GLC 300 and how it compares to the 2024 Cadillac XT4. So let's take these two vehicles on a test drive. All right, so here we are, Savannah and Josh, in another test drive. We are in the Mercedes-Benz GLC 300. Uh, my first impressions just so far driving it kind of the experience when you get in feels 2019 which is not bad i mean it's a 2019 car right? right so just kind of the design of some of the systems uh your mileage your driver information center um is very 2019 which is not bad but it's really nice i mean like this this little button right here that you have where you can switch and you know move around what's going on on your infotainment center is really great there's three driver settings which is really nice so you could have you know yourself uh, another person and then a guest or something like that who might be you know if you're valeting this vehicle ever for people who valet oh, that's interesting just kind of roll back a little bit there there's a two liter engine in this mercedes-benz glc 300 for those that want to know which is great. Large moonroof. Doesn't open though, Savannah figured that out. Yeah, it only tilts. Oh! Mm -hmm. <laughs> we, we almost lost the GoPro again. Again. If you watched our Cadillac test drive, <laughs> uh, I don't know, we didn't show it on there, but we showed it, go to our TikTok channel. Right, we yeah, got, go to we our got TikTok, bloopers. And we got bloopers on TikTok. But, you know, this ride's really smooth. Mm -hmm. It feels like, like I was saying earlier, it feels like my Subaru Crosstrek, but luxury mm. but nice but like nice. i mean my subaru is nice don't get me wrong i love my subaru and honestly i will say some of the things in my subaru are more up to date than this mm. 2019. yeah there's no apple carplay no apple carplay no touch screen um oh, display cool. screen um and it's kind of hard to figure out some things in here the uh the seating oh options, yeah though. i like that i like that a lot so the xt4 you know we're comparing and contrasting the xt4 um massaging seats uh this one there's a button down there oh oh it changes your um lumbar settings okay so that button changes your lumbar settings which is really nice I feel it changing. Yeah, that feels great. I mean, if you keep pressing the button, it might feel like a massage. Right, yeah. <laughs> keep pressing it around. So there's like a lower oh. lumbar, middle lumbar section there. Um, heated seats, not ventilated, but heated seats. Still very nice. But there's four different settings for your seats here, which is super cool. There's like a setting that kind of moves out the front part of the seat, which that's really nice. There's your typical move forward, move back, lower settings on your seats before move back and then this also controls your headrest so you can move your headrest up and down with this top button here talk to call buttons paddle shifters uh, that's also in the xt4 like i said in the comparison video though your gear shifter is in a different place on this glc 300 here it's right here on the glc 300 the cadillac it's here in the center console um, so your hand is kind of always here on the Cadillac. Right. Um, so yeah, that is that is kind of a little bit about the inside of this vehicle. It does ride really smooth. It is very smooth. I like it. And it kind of like, you know, whips around when you need it to. So I do want to talk about pricing with these vehicles. This one right now, it's a used vehicle, 2019, comes in at 28.5. So very affordable, you know, if you like Mercedes, 
um, there. And then the XT4, brand new 2023, that one comes in a little higher at uh, 54,000 about, depending on the packages that you get and features and all that all right. kind of stuff. Uh, so definitely check out our website uh, to look at current pricing. Uh, we are looking at our prices every single day, making sure that we're staying on the market. Um, so definitely check out our website at everettchevy.com or Everett Auto Team or hickoryuse.com. Uh, come by and see us. We'd love to get you in a new vehicle today, whether it's new or it's a new to you vehicle. We'd love to get you in a new vehicle today and we'll see you next time.